Their global epilepsy report is actually their most important document that has been produced in collaboration by the World Health Organization, International League Against Epilepsy and the International Bureau uh, for Epilepsy. Uh, as the next step after the resolution of the 68th World Health Assembly have been accepted. And indeed, the next step will be the action plan for epilepsy. The global report have been developed by more than 50 leading experts from actually all over the world. And it contains a number of chapter addressing the major gaps and the major, uh, the most important issues dealing with care, research, uh, access to medication and all the other issues uh, around epilepsy. Indeed, the burden of epilepsy is enormous and it's indeed one of the most severe and disabling neurological disease. But it could be efficiently treated and indeed, we have a number of new medications, we have a number of new techniques, we have epilepsy surgery, we have other technologies, but in, at the population level, if needed, if uh, there is a limit country or the area with limited resources, quite efficient care can be uh, provided in terms of medication with absolutely low cost, up to five dollars per year. That's definitely not the ideal way of treating epilepsy. However, essential medications are not expensive. And in fact, treatment is absolutely affordable for any country, for any state, for any area. Research in epilepsy is substantially underfunded and we need to address to uh, give more funding for research in epilepsy in all the domains because without adequate research without understanding on the mechanisms of epilepsy it's not possible to develop new medications it's not possible to develop adequate care it's not possible to proceed with the understanding on the function of brain and uh, epilepsy, and epilepsy is often called a window of the brain.